38-year-old Florence Amuge and her husband are the talk of Soroti town after they recently got quadruplets at Soroti Regional Referral Hospital. The babies, three girls and a boy, are all said to be in good condition. The couple from Cabramido are peasant farmers whose number of children has now risen to 11 from the seven that they had. They did not expect to get four babies at once and they're now worried about fending for them. I need help for these children. There are so many and the responsibility is too much. I already have seven children and this is the eighth birth making it 11. Amuge is suffering from a condition called postpartum depression which has made her withdraw from her babies and have severe mood swings. Elderly women have been visiting Amoge to comfort her, but she seems so frustrated. She was expecting uh, a triplets, um, like three children only, and, ev and eventually uh, it was news to her that she, she got an extra baby. So she became depressed and then she, went, she, she, she got that uh, postpartum depression and now she's we referred her to, towards it, psychiatry board for, for, for reviews and and more evaluation. Quadruplets are quite rare compared to twins or triplets. In other news, police in Mitiana have arrested a 66-year-old man for allegedly defiling his two daughters. Joseph Chigundu, a resident of Kalangalo in Mitiana, is said to have been committing the despicable act to his daughters aged 6 and 13 since 2007 when his wife divorced him. He called me to the bedroom and I asked him why. He asked me, you mean you don't know? He shouted, hurry up before your sister comes back. He has been defiling them in bits since their mother left home in 2007, but he told them not to tell anyone threatening to kill them. The traumatized children reported their ordeal to the neighbors who in turn informed the police. The girl confesses that the father has been defiling her for a number of times. We've already arrested, uh, arrested Chigundu Joseph. He's already in our coolers at Tetema Police Post, pending further investigations. The two girls were examined at a hospital where it was confirmed that they were indeed defiled.